<laughs> Speaking of long lost generations and families, I want y'all to hear this dude. Oh. Oh. And a lot of women having an issue calling me a deadbeat because oh, I tell them I, I was being irresponsible, yet yeah, not wearing protection. But I always tell uh, these women that I got pregnant that I do not want to be a father to these children. And I offer to pay for the abortion. Majority of times, they'll either take the abortion or they'll take a plan B. But only these seven have kept these children. But the crazy thing about it is they want me to be responsible for some children I told them I did not want. So for some years now, do not want. And I don't give a what nobody think about it. You're not going to force children upon me. Yeah, we both made the decision to lay down and have intercourse. We both was irresponsible about the decisions we made that night. Yeah, I could have pulled out, but I didn't. <laughs> that's, I don't know why. I'm, I'm like, not the one that's going to have to carry a baby for nine months. Wow. It's the woman. In my opinion, wow. women should be more careful on who they sleep with. You should because too, nigga. Because you going to be like one of my baby mothers trying to find me so She's I can financially me. support a kid I didn't told her or them I did not want. Another thing is, these just jump offs. See? These are the type of women that I ain't you even see? had to do nothing for. The bad minimum. But they gave me access to their body, and they think I want to be a, a father to a child for one of them? But I don't even have no type of love for these women. How do they expect me to love these children? Before y'all say, wow. Okay, Wow, no, I don't even want, I, we don't even got to go no further. I want to hear his little yeah. disclaimer. Oh, you want to hear the last part? You hear me say I don't take he, what accountability. Yeah, I do. I just don't give a f- You ain't going to force these children on me when I told you I ain't want them. Yeah, I can offer to a pay for abortion, but at what point can I force a woman to go get an abortion? I cannot. A woman say, my body, my choice, but I say, it's my life, my choice. Before y'all try to stitch this shit like black men this, black men that, I don't give a <laughs> <laughs> You don't take accountability. Yeah, I do. I just don't give a That. Some of them been just... Well, yeah. Respo- response. Responses. Because I already... You got a point, but... My whole thing is, how you gonna sit up here and tell women to be accountable for who they lay with? And you just laying with anybody, too. Like, you like, they jump all. I would never raise a child... That's the Why whole thing about having right sex, there? though. You know that if I lay down with this jump off, the potential for a child is, on, is, is a high chance. No, 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 no. It's a chance. It's way a chance. more than a high chance. You heard what he said. He said, yeah, I'll be shooting the club up, but I don't care. I just know that either A, I'm going to get a plan B, or I'm going to have somebody get an abortion. People like him. He, um, no, he literally. That's what's wrong with black people, it shouldn't be anyone busting it open for him black after this people. video. It that's should not. With, but there don't do be. that to black people. No, just, no one that's wrong with on black this people. planet after this has gone viral should be sleeping with Unless they people. already got a baby by him. Y'all already, clearly. No, don't make any more. Do us a favor. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> that, but that's the same. But that's the, and when I say black people, I mean certain black people who have fatherless children. Because... People like him, he don't. He wanted to have all the sex that he want to have, and don't want to deal with the consequences of the sex. And then women that he had sex with be like, "Come on, have sex me up," and I want to keep the baby. And now this baby is gonna be raised, to lost be like in society. Well, you can't blame it'll be like him will be worse. Or worse is. You know what I'm saying? So here's my thing: you can't blame women for this. I blame all. everybody, man, for that. No, I'm gonna tell you why. Everybody involved. Everybody involved. Yeah, I blame him for it, yo. No, women are women are under the spell of men, typically. Especially when it comes to them giving their bodies to them. It's an advantage that you have, that you've used to your advantage several times, that we all have, but I think you gotta admit it. I think it has to be admitted to a point. I think it go both ways. Yeah, it go I think both ways. Stop. And I think the main problem is people worship themselves too much because all they look to do is gratify their loans. At the end Fine, of the day, whatever. everything everybody is, de- okay, everything is sitting de- around de- gratifying your loans. When <laughs> your loans, your, it's, it's a lot of responsibility that comes with so that. So it's either this or, or, or back in the day when shit like this happened, you know what will happen. 
What would happen? They get the, the lights off? The, no, the families, the families will make the two people get married. Oh, yeah. Whether they liked it or not. You will hope. Well, I mean, it happened more, it happened, it happened more, happened more, more, it happened more happen. often than it would happen in yeah. today's world. Yeah. yeah, for sure. Or even because sometimes the guy more. just was like, all right, I'm going to step up. It's my kid. Yeah, but this nigga just That's knocking him down. Like, not like, after one. He just dumb. No, yeah. not after two. And no, like she said, if three. any woman decides to lay down with him, even if he like, girl, you know what? If I have a baby with you, I'm going to be it. Yeah, I Man. just don't understand the the idea of trapping a guy because uh, I imagine that's what he feels like. No, that's what some some women some you know women actually that. actually feel that way. Like they feel like they you know a baby will keep a nigga. Mm -hmm. Okay, it never does, but um, sometimes it never does. It just doesn't keep them in the capacity that they wanted them. Um, so I. It's everyone's to blame. Like the he's irresponsible and nasty, but for a woman to allow him to yeah. nut up in her, yeah. knowing what type of dude he is, or just or the, the ramifications of being nutted, nutted, nutted the pond, nutted the pond, nutted the pond. That's just a lie. Hey, can we name this? And poor, and, and poor, <laughs> and poor, and, and, and you know the kids are the victims in all this. The kids are the victims. Oh man, poor babies. And that's why I was saying going, going back to your ancestors at this point. But, babies. but just think, these man, kids don't stand a chance. Look at the statistics, yo. Two parent households typically bring the best children and best adults. That's what mm -hmm. Deion Sanders said. I heard his little speech he gave about the type of well, quarterbacks. Uh, we were specific for the position. Yeah, yes, yeah. and but there was reasoning behind that. He was like, yeah. I, my defensive line, man. I want that <laughs> nigga to have a single mother. Yep. Uh, no father. And there was reasoning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, y'all want to know what's interesting? Y'all want to know what's interesting about that? I want that boy to be hungry. Right. That's what he said. Y'all want to know what's interesting about that? What's that? His son is a quarterback. I know. Him for their team. And their parents aren't. His parents aren't together. And his either. parents aren't together. They were though. And he's so okay. So that doesn't heavily count. Involved, he's heavily involved. That is true. That is true because they were once. And both the parents are. Yeah. Okay. They both heavily involved mother in, mother in, and in their life. Are. Okay, so yeah. I give them a break. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. But <laughs> but just, just statistically, and statistics say for children that's raised in a single parent household, and just think about the children that feel neglected, and they know that their dad don't want nothing to do with them. Like they don't. I don't even think they have a stat for that. Was but it we know. Carl Malone, sir. <laughs> yeah. But he's an anomaly because he but they made, also, it, to he the made it to the NFL and he had gifted athletic genes as well right. from his That's father. That's not an anomaly. I feel like sometimes it, is it an can go no, His father had genes that anybody looking at but him. But I'm saying that, that dude right genes. there probably don't have athletic genes. So they those kids probably not going to grow and be like, one day I'm going to meet my father because I'm going to be a starting left tackle in the NFL with a $30 right. million dollar contract. No, I'm saying it could, go, <laughs> it could go both ways in that you could grow up in a situation where it's like, you know, when I get a... a uh, when I become an adult, I will never be like this. Right. I know how it felt. I'll never put a child through right. this. You know, it could go the other yeah. way too. Well, it, could, it could also that person could end up in jail. He, he could end up drop out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I said it could go both ways. She could end up pregnant. There's a lot a of good fathers out here now because of that type of situation. Yes, right. they like, man, I'm gonna be a great father yeah. because because my father wasn't. Right. You know what I'm saying. I'll say this. I think we've gotten away from the idea of some of the traditional things that we were raised on and our parents were raised on, like being married before having children. Um, although we understand. Hmm? <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the bastard. 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 I'm the I have a child outside of a marriage, too. So that's not the point. What I'm saying is, those values were still instilled in us in a way where something like this, where somebody goes online and and does it, it's not it's not this person has literally no idea. I don't give a fuck. That's Come what on, man. Like, <laughs> and Just we understand that we can teach women. our children things, but sometimes they, they fail. Be like, Come on, in yeah, people out. fail. People fail all the time. Not but the knowing thing. what's right and knowing what's wrong is the responsibility of this individual. His parents. It's not solely on him. At this age, you guys. At this age, it's not solely on him. Whoever he lay up with, it's on them too. Exactly. 
I, I think, think I just think don't have him finessing me. Like I think I'm it's trying 60, to figure out what he said. Yeah. I think it's sixty finesse. forty. So I think you I think they also target a certain type of. Oh, obviously, uh, and that's my point. That's uh, why sixty forty. Nah, men. I'm sorry. I agree dog. with you. I no, agree. I'm saying men have 64. more of a responsibility. I agree with men. Think, should have more responsibility. But they do. Period. I think it just boils down to the level of consciousness in both individuals, him and her. Whoever has more wherewithal of the situation, what it is. Then more than likely it's him. More than likely it's him. Because he more knows it's the man. I'm a ski in these joints. The and and they I, get pregnant. Yeah, I ain't gonna be yeah. here. Them girls ain't thinking like that off. more than likely. Yeah, he, he like, or, I'm paying yeah. more. So that's what and I'm they saying. Don't want but the money. there probably have been women that they took the money. That has got to be expensive. Or the plan B. Or that has got to be expensive. But what he said was he ain't do nothing to get them. So the same five, six, seven hundred dollars that you would spend on a date. To He's try to impress somebody. I'm like, who's spending that much well, on a date? Uh, Two dates. A, a, a portion. Okay. About four hundred, five hundred. How much? Oh, it I don't know. It's like two fifty or something. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think that expensive. I'm right? just trying to. Nah, not no more. That's what I'm saying. What? They be wanting you to do it. You can sometimes. They be wanting you to do it. <laughs> and you, sometimes you can get one for free. Nah, used to be like that. I don't know I since they reversed the Roe versus Wade oh, thing. I don't oh, know how it is now. I I couldn't tell you how much. They had free clinics for that. Yeah, that's true. That's what free clinics are for. And that's why a lot of people are like, nah, I don't want my help. I don't want my taxes to pay for no. Yeah, but I don't yeah. want them wow. type of abortions if I'm gonna get one. I don't want them. What's the, what's those type? I don't. What? I don't want the free ones. <laughs> oh, you feel like something uh, janky with the free what, ones? What? What? What do you mean? <laughs> I went to Denny's one time and I had a horrible experience and started to argue with the manager and then I looked around. I was like, damn. Denny's. Denny's. <laughs> what you expect? What the fuck did I expect, bro? And I was like, you no, know what? No, no, no. This I was is like, you know what? Have a good day. It's fine. It's cool. Like, this, this is me? my fault. <laughs> Are, you Are you kidding no, me? No, for real. Hair <laughs> and my ex? <laughs> really? <laughs> Uh, po- you know, you start you know, you say being, how preposterous is that? Uh, Not to mention, I had lip marks on my cup. <laughs> Not to mention. <laughs> then my waiter, on my cup, he didn't even introduce himself. <laughs> I'm sorry, what's your name, sir? Right. I don't even know this guy. Right. <laughs> and don't let him get teased him in high school. <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> 